Hi, I'm Becky Perez. Welcome to Amazing Science Lessons. I will be demonstrating a math activity. The objective is to identify and add sets of numbers. The children will be creating my addition booklet. Through this activity, we have targeted some skills that the children will be developing. Let me share them with you. One of them is, it's a counting strategy. They will be counting the dots on this number Q to the picture cards, the counting strategy. Objects in a set, they will be matching the picture card to the number. They'll be making sets. They will also be doing addition up to six, and I will demonstrate for you in a little bit. And they will be writing number sentences. Example, three plus one equals four. The materials needed for this activity, you're going to need the activity sheet of the life cycle. I mean, this is the one on, on the ladybug. Two uh, just regular white copy paper and one sheet of construction paper. You're also going to need a glue stick, a permanent marker, a blank number cube, and of course a pencil. Another thing that's important that this activity sheet, you can put it maybe at your fine arts center and have the children cut it and put them in a basket so you have that ahead of time and I'm going to demonstrate how to do the booklet but also will be pre prepared ahead of time. All you do, you just take the two uh, sheets and just crease it. Take the other one, crease it, and just insert it, the two sheets inside the book. Open up the book and staple it. I'm going to go ahead and put three. One, two, three. Now, we're going to make a title for the cover of our book. And it's, and it's titled, My Edition Booklet. My Edition Book. B O O K. Now, to do this activity, you're going to have your number cube prepared ahead of time, and you will need a permanent marker. Okay? And I'm going to show you what you're going to do. You're going to take and just uh, on the top, go ahead and just draw a one dot. On the other side, draw the other one. And then next, draw two dots. Go to the next one, two more. And go to the other side and draw three. One, two, three. And on the other side, one, two, three. So you have this prepared also ready for the children to work. So the way this activity is done, you throw your dice, your, your number cube. Okay, so it's three. So I want to get three pictures. So it's one, two, three. And we're going to glue them. Okay. <laughs> glue that. The next one next to it. It's important that they put it next to it. And then we, we count it. And it's three. One, two, three. And we write the number three. Right and we throw the number cube again. Now we have two. So we get two pictures. And we glue it. It was two, so we put two. One, two. And we write the number two. We count it. One, two. And of course, you're modeling for this. And then they we're modeling for them. And they know about to write the number sentence. So we, so we have three plus two equals five. So we're going to count. One, two, three, four, 
5. So we write the number 5. It's like this. And we go and we do this again. So I'm going to show you again. Okay, 1. So we put, put 1. And then we write the number 1. So important that they write, after they blew the picture, that they write the number 1. So we throw our number cube again, and we have 1 again. So then we glue it, and we put 1. So we put 1 egg, so we write 1. Okay, now we know, so now we're going to write the number sentence, and we're going to count it. So we say 1 plus 1 equals 2. So we stand like this. Now, but you can also vary this activity. What you can do here, you can just have the students count the dots. So we can throw. So it's one dot. So we put, we glue one. And then we write, underneath, we write the number one. Okay. Then two. Just, just, just continue doing this. Two. So it's two pictures. I want to take two. One, two. And I'm going to glue two. And after it's glued, count it again. One, two, and I write. Then we'll write the number two. So see they're matching the, the number and the picture card. So it's a really good activity for children to do in math and it's fun and they're learning the addition facts up to six. This concludes this demonstration. Thank you.